Hey guys, AJ here, back with another one for you. So guys, we all know that these 304s are terrible about making decisions, right? Guys, come on, right? Student loan debt, credit card debt, right? Getting scammed by Pookie and, and Nug Nug, right? <laughs> Having bastard kids, right? Come on, dude. Not the best decision makers at all, right? And guys... All this while they're still trying to say they're strong and independent. I am woman, hear me roar, and numbers too big to ignore. <laughs> hey guys, they still claim to have this, this women's intuition, right? This Highlander-like sense <laughs> of when something bad's going to happen or to figure things out. And we all know, guys, that that's BS, right? If you honestly believe that women's intuition is a thing. You've been had. You've been took. You've been hoodwinked. Clown world, right? So guys, we you go to Dumpster Fire and notice TikTok and look at some of these delusional 304s actually saying that that women's intuition is a thing. But before we do, guys, like, subscribe, check out my locals, second channel, playlist at the end, guys, and let's get into this. Part of maturing as a woman is realizing that we have intuition for a reason. Clown we world. have intuition to guide us, not to ignore. And I'm not talking about insecurities. I'm not talking about jealousy. I'm not talking about any of that. I'm talking about when you think that you should go left, but something in your chest, something in your heart, something in your stomach, it changed your whole mood. It's like I wanted to go left, but something in my body is telling me to go right. That feeling should never be ignored. Look at that, guys. Guys, uh, come on. Everything she said. The lie detector determined that was a lie. Oh! And guys, the only feeling that these 304s have in their stomach is Nug Nug's bastard child after he <laughs> shot up the club. <laughs> and guys, guys, these chicks claim honestly that all oh, they have some intuition, yet they still let Nug Nug and Gerardo and Gavin. The the starving artist hit the walls. Give him the high five. Give him the herp derp, right? Knock him up. Come on, dude. You know what I'm saying? If this women's intuition thing was an actual thing, then they wouldn't have 75% of the student loan debt. They wouldn't have all these all these kids out of wedlock, right? They wouldn't have these horrible outcomes that that have been happening to women for the last 50 years. You guys, there's like 83 comments in here and all these chicks are all saying the same thing. If I feel that something's wrong, it, it's wrong. Yet I've learned to listen to myself no matter what. Clown world. It's never failed me yet. These chicks are cooked. And guys, her hashtags. You ready? Hashtag superpower. Hashtag intuition. Hashtag women's intuition. Hashtag feelings. Hashtag astrology. Of course. Of course, next we're going to talk about being a Capricorn, all this foolishness, clown world. Just know when you're lying or hiding shit. Please, Please understand this, <laughs> because men just don't seem to understand this. When we're asking you questions, we already know the answer. We already know the answer. Sometimes we just want to see if you're going to tell us and admit it, and maybe we could fix the problem. But when you lie and lie and lie and lie, and I already know... Yeah. For, like, I don't want to say 100% of the time, but I want to say a good 80% of the time when I'm asking a question, at least me, mm. I know. The of truth course, 100%. And if I don't know the truth, by the way you're going to answer it, I already know I already the line. Facts. Because you're with this person all the time. Like, you, you know. You know what I mean? And if I'm asking you a question, I don't care what we're talking about. I don't care what the lie is. If mm -hmm. you lie to me about something small, off rip, I'm looking at you like you lie about everything. If right. you lie to me about something small, you lie about everything, period. I don't care. You can't tell me nothing. I don't trust you. Women always know when you're... Here you go, guys. Right there. And guys, let me break out the race card here. Let me, let me just do this quick. Guys, that, to all my white subscribers out there, all you white dudes, guys, there's all these B-dubs out here swirling, meaning they only date white guys. Guys, they're all yours. <laughs> They're all yours, guys. They're all yours. <laughs> Listen to how masculine that these knuckleheads sound. Right? Look at this. Look at that, guys. Come on, man. Absolutely insane. And then then this, I don't know if, if it's like a New York accent. Ugh, but if you lie to me about one thing, you lie to me. Guys, this proves that these two chicks have only dated Nug Nug. 
Gavin, right? Because guys, men, guys, we, why do we need to lie? Why? You know what I'm saying? Look, mo men that are actually worth a damn will just tell you, look, hey, look, I did this. You know what I'm saying? But they surround themselves with pookies and nug nugs to, that actually have to try and grift them, right? And they want to try and say all men do this. Clown world. And guys, if they're so good at knowing when men lie, how do they end up letting nug nugs say, oh yeah, I put a con condom on her? Huh? Right? <laughs> yeah, I don't have the high five. <laughs> I don't have the hurt derp, right? Where's your intuition then? Where's your ability to, to say it after being lied to then? And guys, they have 1,293 comments. And guys, they're all the same. Yeah, yeah, men gaslight. Yeah, I can tell when he's lying. Yeah, yeah. Guys, why would anyone at the right mind be with anyone that they, that they know constantly lies to them? You have to catch them in lies. And guys, these three or fours, actually will go out of their way right like where now with chicks like like this you have one foot in the grave anyways because they just assume that you're just gonna lie and you wonder why so many guys are in monk mode just leaving these broads alone guys men minding their own business that's what i'm saying mind your own business business guys all these chicks here are all saying the same thing they tell on themselves their accents and what they say and this chick she calls herself Big Booty Nanny NYC. Both my gut and my dreams have been proving my point. Her dreams? Look at that! <laughs> Clown world. Guys, if you with some broad that, that ever says, I had a dream you did this. Guys, just get up and walk away. Guys, her hashtags. Hashtag intuition matters. Hashtag trust your instincts. Hashtag... Relationship insights, clown work. <laughs> man, oh man, look at this knucklehead right here, guys. <laughs> I guarantee nothing good is going to come out of this knucklehead's mouth. <laughs> A woman's intuition is dangerous. If she keeps questioning you, over and over again about a specific topic it's because her instincts has already sent off warning signals most of the time she already knows the truth but wants to see if you are going to be honest with her you've been had you've been took you've been hoodwinked bamboozled let us stray Guys, come on. <laughs> Do I even need to say anything? <laughs> oh, guys, 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 guys. <laughs> Chicks are delusional, man. They are delusional. Man, oh man, oh man. And guys, let's just let's just do a hypothetical and say that this was true. Let's just say that there was some type of women's intuition. All these chicks now are are smoking weed more than ever before, abusing alcohol, on antidepressants more. You really think that there's some type of women's intuition uh, when all these chicks are all jacked up, right? On all these drugs and alcohol, right? You think I'm drunk with us? I can't. I just have mental health issues. <laughs> hey guys, are hashtags? You ready? Hashtag intuition. Hashtag woman. Hashtag motivation. Hashtag inspiration. Hashtag motivate. Hashtag follow me. Hashtag astrology. Another one, astrology. Guys, don't. Buy into this intuition crap with these broads. 
Because if they had any type of sense, they wouldn't make the mistakes that they make. So, all right, you guys, this is AJ. I appreciate you guys. Like, subscribe, and I'm out of here, guys. Have a good one.